Hi everyone, welcome back. Welcome back to Crater Day 6, and that's crafting every day in August. Um, I want to let you all know that I did create a crater for August 5th. I recorded more than the allotted time on the phone, which is 33 minutes and 10 seconds. So it ran over into another video, although when I'm looking at my phone, it shows that I'm still recording. So I was up to 40 something minutes, almost an hour. But when I got ready to upload it, it was in two parts. So I thought I would be smart, which turned out to be very dumb, and transfer the data to my computer and then upload it to YouTube and combine it like that. And it's still uploading to YouTube. So you'll see part one and part two of Krata after um, well, you see part one and part two of Crater Day 5 after you see Crater Day 6 because I'm going to keep this, even if it's longer than 33 minutes and 10 seconds, I'm just going to upload it from the phone because it takes my phone about an hour, if that, to upload a 30 minute video versus the computer, which I started uploading it yesterday at 6 p.m. after I got very frustrated. And it's currently 5.05 a.m. on August 6th. So I haven't quit yet. I don't plan on quitting. I don't think at least. So what I want to try to do today is create a scene using Julie Nutting stamps and paper. And I've already pre-stamped this lady using this color box design paper. And it has 100 sheets. And these pieces are very flimsy. I think I discussed this before because I've used the same young lady before and these are called calendar must they don't have a, a real name so what I'm going to do is I want to take a um, eight and a half by eleven sheet of paper and I'm going to get out this this one right here and I'm going to stamp what I want to do as well is I want to take her and put her on some type of uh, cardstock and then build a scene around that. And what I mean by building a scene is I'm going to take her, the girl, stamp her on some white paper because I don't want her to have lines or de de um, designs on her and this is real busy. Um, so I'm going to take that paper, put, put her on some white cardstock so she looks normal, fussy cut her dress out and then um, build the scene around that. So right now I'm just going to pause the camera and I'm gonna cut some paper. So while I'm digging out the paper, I figured we could chat. I went to Michael's and Hobby Lobby yesterday and I haven't completely sworn off going to the big, big box craft stores, but I have been spending less, which is awesome for my pocketbook or purse. I call it a purse, but a lot of people call it a pocketbook um, because you know Michael stay having their hands in your pocket but today they have a 20% 25% off total purchase after noon I think or after four some some weird hour um, and they have a lot of their Halloween stamps out and I got one and I don't have the, the stamp over here but I got one which I really really wanted to get all of them so I'm gonna have to wait um, only because I don't think 25% is better than 50 or 60%. So I think they'll probably have that, you know, stamp sale before October. You know, buy one, get one free or buy one. Yeah, buy one, get one free or buy one, get one half off. And um, they'll have the 20 or 25% off total purchase again. So I think that would be great for me. And now I've got this crate paper. Out. I don't know the name of this one. Um, it just says paper pad. Let's see. Yep, it doesn't have a name on it. And I believe I got this in a D stash. If not, I purchased it from Tuesday morning. So now I'm just looking at the papers and seeing what color will go best. And remember, I'm just coloring her dress. And I'm thinking that I'm going to use this color right here. I think I'm gonna use this color or either these banners but you know how I feel about banner things if you watched a live or maybe this color because the it's yellow in those patterns so I think I'm gonna just pull out a yellow sheet something plain because I do want to embellish it up a lot and I'm going to try to go to the Dollar Tree 
and see if they have any more of those shadow box frames and put it in there. So wish me luck on all of the above. I'm going to pause the video now because I don't want to ramble on too much. And I don't want to have to have you all watch three and four videos unless that was my original intent, which is not. Okay, so we are back. And I just want to say something really quickly. Um, I posted up the stamp. This one right here, the little house mouse stamp that mom to create gave me. I posted that video a couple of days ago. And then I was looking at my pictures that I posted on Instagram. And I was looking at the edges of the paper. And I've been using that We Are Memory Keepers cutting machine. Which, even though I think it cuts off a little bit, um, I want to say that most of the error is most likely myself. And I need to just adjust that. But these edges are very frayed. And in this instance, I am going to make the edges a little bit of um, distress so it's no big deal but just keep that in mind when you see your paper looking kind of funky you may need to change your blade and I may have to do that later on if I need clean cuts so what I did is I took the 12 by 12 and cut it down to 7 by 5 and then I took this white cardstock which I'm going to stamp on um, now and I cut it down to 4 by 6 and then you already saw these ladies. I just decapitated them and um, cut their legs off, which is creepy to me, even though it's a stamp. Um, but these colors, in my opinion, go well with this, like burnt or um, burnt yellow, I guess you could say, or um, mustard color, because these colors kind of pull out in there. So I think that's good. And then this little, these dots look really good. The only thing about these dots is that they don't really flow with the skirt. Um, if you notice, they're just there. The skirt is there and the dots are there. So um, just keep that in mind if you are a perfectionist when it comes to that sort of thing. I'm going to be using my Stamp Perfect tool um, by Hero Arts that is no longer in production from my understanding because of copyright infringements or whatever. But this was gifted to me by mom to create. Um, thank you again. If you have ever gifted me something and I can remember who gave it to me, I'll always say your name in the videos. Or if you give me an idea, I always try to use your name in video. So just keep that in mind um, if you've given me something or gifted me something. If I can remember, like I used something from Tracy. Um, and I didn't even realize it was from her because I have a few boxes from friend mail that I've received and um, it has spilled over and I thought it was like one of my own purchases from a D stash or something because some of the stuff that you all send me I would never ever think to buy even if I like it I don't know why that's just how I how weird I am and that's one lady we're only going to be doing two today and we might even get to the second one because I don't want I hate 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 that my videos are not posted yet it bothers me a lot that's why I try to keep some um, videos pre-recorded so even though you didn't get a vape a crater yesterday you did get a video from me and it was about um, storage how do you store your ephemera packs so now that I've started working on this project I'm thinking okay you got the stamps you got stuff out now what are you gonna do so I want to put some lace around the paper um, which I think is gonna be awesome because I only have a certain a few colors available to me right now I've been trying as you know I've been trying to put stuff up and there we are and I want to say, I wonder why they just didn't include an extra set of magnets, considering they know that we're going to clink for me. I clink mine, to, I grab mine in my hand together, which is not a good thing to do. And I'm trying to be more cognitive of that. Um, in my video from yesterday, I said, excuse me, I'm just getting the baby wipe out, that I um, was going to go to the harvest 
Harbor Freight Tools, but I didn't get a chance to make it there. Um, it was hot and I was upset. <laughs> um, I really, really like these planner stamps. I never noticed this until just now. It says zero to 14 years. So zero to 14 years, you can't play with these planner stamps. I wonder if it's one of those things that, you know, how you get some things and it says it's known to cause cancer um, in the state of California or whatever. I know they have to put that on there. But I wonder why they put 14 years because some stamp says zero to three like kids. Kids know how to stamp. Let's just put it like that. Um, so I have this lady. And we're going to dress her up now. Dress her. And I think that I'm going to color her hair brown. I like brown for hair. Brown black for hair. Um, that's just my preference, I guess. Do you all want to see me cut this out? I don't think you need to see me cut this out. I've, I've shown my um, fussy cutting skills. It's not that great. Um... I guess since I've already started, huh? I just need to be very aware of the time. And I don't understand why my phone is doing that because I have like a large, um, what is that thing called? SD card. I got a larger one. It's like 64 or 120. Eight, I believe um, so I was looking at online and it was like you need to format it differently blah 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 and it was like no it's just the way Samsung is set up because even when I downloaded that open camera app that um, Carmen from Elemental Design suggested it still did the same thing so now that I'm thinking about it I have a video on my computer that I didn't upload and this um, the one I did with the altered hats that I probably will never upload now because it's going to take forever to do that and I, I no longer have the hats I've taken them to work so it's no big deal we'll probably only get a chance to do one because you all know I'm a slow crafter right super slow crafter and I want to say that um, I've seen people do Julie Nutting dolls or any of their stamps like this, but I haven't. Um, so I, I don't, I can't say I saw one person do what I'm about to do. Uh, a lot of ladies have done it, even on the packaging for Julie Nutting, some of her I guess design team maybe. I don't know if she has a design team or not. But maybe people created stuff and sent it in. I don't know. But you can see it on there too. So that's what I'm going to be doing. I'm not I don't really work with sentiments a lot, if you've noticed. If I gift this to someone, they can put what sentiment they want on there. And I think since Julie Nutting dolls are expressionless, that makes it even better. Um, because you can give you can set the tone, you can set her mood. You can say what she likes or doesn't like. I have only watched a few videos this weekend. My little roommate, and if you are a parent, you probably already know this and you just didn't tell me, is very demanding of the television remote. He only wants to watch what he wants to watch. And I don't really have a problem with him watching what he wants to watch. But there has to be a happy medium. We have to meet in the midway point. And we have to say, okay, listen. I'm not watching any more of this cartoon stuff. Not one more episode. Um, but it does keep him entertained. What I don't like is that it's not really a learning show. They do teach lessons in the show. Like, you know, about patience and things like that. But the heroes... Are the people that learn the lesson not the villains which is hmm, interesting to say the least 
um, very interesting so here we are at this point I'm going to pause the camera and do a few things off camera only because I want to do it that way okay so before you all worry or wonder what the heck I did I just rounded the corners um, because I like my corners rounded um, and I tried to do some distressing but it really didn't distress it as much as I wanted to distress it so we're gonna leave it alone and we are going to distress it on the other lady we'll lose some funkiness on the other lady I want to try some drops and we'll see where that goes so ooh. oh nuts I was messing with my ruler that I have <laughs> And it fell out of the little container that I use and it knocked over it knocked over the um my bead jar. Not my bead jar. Yeah, my um jar where I keep all of the charms I'm working on, the little bucket and knocked it over. Um so yeah. I am tempted to go to Michael's today, but I don't think I will go to Michael's today because I went there yesterday and I need to run some real errands like for sustainment, which is food. I need to get some things. I'm trying to do a meal plan per week um, just so I can have everything prepared. I know a lot of people cook all of their food on Sunday and then they just heat it up throughout the week and I don't really care to do that what I like to do though is prepare a lot of randomness on a specific day like say if I do a lot of randomness on Monday I can use some of the leftover pieces of the randomness for a meal on Wednesday or Friday I'm going to take this off off camera so we don't waste some time okay so um, in the comment section below if you're okay with watching a two-part video um, let me know and I will uh, keep that in mind the only reason why these videos are longer Friday Saturday and Sunday is because I'm off on the weekends and Friday I had training so I was able to do a little bit of a longer video but tomorrow we will be back to the hopefully under 15 minute videos I think I'm going to do a crochet project tomorrow a quick little crochet project um, and that will probably be a two part I'm just put some I'm not gonna pop her up I'm just going to do it just like that and I probably should have colored her hair before I um, glued her down but I didn't so that crochet project will probably be two parts versus one. Okay. Let me go ahead and color her hair and shoes. Okay, so I just used my little paper for swatching out and I got two of the browns from this low Cornell and um color her hair and her shoes I made them green her hair is not green her hair is brown and then I made her belt green which is cool I like green as you all know that's one of my favorite colors yay for green so now what I was thinking about doing because I'm not sure about this um, decorating thing. I plugged in my glue gun and it's warming up. And I'm not using my favorite glue gun still. Um, I know. I know, I know, I know. Um, I'm not going to use this color. It's just yellow, I think is the color that was on there. But I'm just going to look and see how that looks. 
because I haven't used my buttons in a while and I think that's what we're gonna do I'm gonna bust out these buttons and I'm just gonna grab a handful and go from there and I got some flowers that I want to use I'm just gonna throw a whole bunch of randomness on here and see where that takes us hopefully to a happy place I'm so hungry um, <laughs> right now I normally wait to eat breakfast with my little one um, because I like doing that uh, but I may have to grab something before he gets up. I don't want to make it too yellow, so I think I'm going to pull out a random, and I don't know what I did with these. I think I put them in, a, in my container with all of these little jewels like that. So I could use some bling, and I'll, but I want to put a flower right here. So let me go ahead and pull that flower out now. I'm going to use this flower that I made a while back. I'm going to put that right there. So I guess I'm not really making a scene because I didn't put a whole bunch of extra stuff on here. But I'm going to put that flower here. And I'm going to make another video this morning, hopefully, where I won't be so pressed for time. And I'm going to be making some flowers. I'm supposed to be doing a swap with Teresa Creations and I haven't I've only been working on some of them because um, my little roommate has been destroying stuff lately for whatever reason he's been destroying stuff and that's I don't I won't even talk about um, animal prints I'm just not big into animal prints things I guess yet so while this glue gun is hot I'm gonna go ahead and put this backing down I do have another project that I want to work on I have a few that are in my head not written down and I haven't decided if I want to make them a part of the crater because that would definitely have to be a weekend project or if I want to um, just craft it out. I think I'm just going to craft it out. Um, nope. How about black? How about black? Nope. Nope. That is Nicholas in the background. He's telling me that it's time for him to eat, and he's absolutely correct. Um, I am going to stop recording um, at the 30 minute mark. So, whatever I haven't done, that's what we're going to leave it at. Um, I'm going to use this Jot brand stickers. I want to use this flower right here. And this will just be a menagerie of uh, various types of flowers. So we got a paper flower, a sticker, and a jeweled flower, which I think overall it turned out okay. This is not the scene I was planning on making, but it's going to be the scene for today um, because I don't want my video to not upload. I don't want to have two videos floating in electronic land waiting to c come on. Um, thank you all for watching. Uh, let me know if you don't mind two part videos and that way I don't have to feel so rushed when I create videos. I can just upload them as is and I can just say part one, part two. Um, I really appreciate all of your support and understanding I think I've responded to all of the comments now I can't always respond right away
because I do have a full-time job that is very demanding of my mental capacity. Not so much of my physical capacity, but I'm always called upon to think. Friday, everyone left the office at um, probably 1.30. I left at 4. So, if that gives you any mindset of what's going on in my life, there you have it. But you can always email me. And even if I don't respond to your email, I do check my email probably once or twice a day or every other day sometimes. So this is what we have. It's not what I intended, but it is going to have to do for now. Thank you all for watching. Happy Crater.